interesting day down at Wimbledon. Prospects tomorrow, though, are quite a lot better. Here's the blanket of cloud that moved in from the west during the day, bringing its rain as well. But you can see how the gaps have appeared in the cloud over the past few hours. And there's lots of evening sunshine to come across many, many parts of the country. Even in London, in West London here, you can see a few gaps appearing. Some very pleasant blue skies, so there could yet be some evening play down there at Wimbledon with some sunshine as well. Elsewhere, we can see on the radar screen some heavy showers across Ireland, pushing up into Scotland as well. Some more persistent rain still to come across the far north of Scotland. And here's the rain still lying across parts of East Anglia and through Kent as well. But that should clear away very quickly from the west. So some evening sunshine to come in many areas, but watch out for those heavier showers as you go across into northwestern parts of Britain. That's where the heaviest showers are going to continue tonight as well. One or two down through Wales and southwest England perhaps. For many central and eastern parts, it'll become fine and clear. And temperatures everywhere tonight in the breeze, staying around about 10 degrees, so not cold by any means. That's how the weather chart looks just now with this area of low pressure moving up into northern Scotland and staying there really for the next 24 hours. A lot of showers mixed in with the sunshine coming around that low pressure as we go through into tomorrow. This system here is going to actually just move to the south, probably just giving some heavy rain across northern parts of France. But there will be some quite blustery winds blowing across the entire British Isles as we go through tonight and through tomorrow as well, revolving around the centre of low pressure up there across northeastern Scotland by this time on Thursday. Not a bad start, at least for the first session over at Trent Bridge. I think it'll probably stay fine for a while, but there will be showers developing through the day. I'm afraid there could be one or two interruptions there, but temperatures picking up to about 19 degrees and quite a blustery southwesterly wind. Fairly clear then in central and eastern parts of the country to start the day, but there will be the showers in the north and the west, and those showers giving some uh, quite wet weather, I think, as we go through the day. The more widespread showers as you go up into northern and western parts of Scotland and moving southeastwards through the day. Top temperature, 19 to 21 down through central and southeastern parts of England. A very cool 13 in the wind up in northern Scotland. And that area of low pressure, that same area of low pressure, is going to be around right the way through the weekend as well. It means to say sunshine and showers virtually everywhere. And as the winds fall lighter, some of those showers could be quite lengthy. That's it from me.